anymore. Does any of it matter? Do you, any of you even care who I am physically? Hello, my name is David, media mogul of the future. Right now I'm sitting in my room outside Fort Hood debating on what I should do with the rest of my life. And I decided that the only thing I should be doing is not doing that where you see my chin. You sons of bitches. Or the world. Last time we spoke on this vlog called I Know My First Name Is David. That's right. My name is David. I was in California and I did a blog. A vlog. A vlog. Vlog. Video log. About my log. And how big it was. And that I was moving. I don't even think I mentioned that I was moving. But then on 4th of July weekend, I basically teleported myself from Irvine, California to the future. To Austin, Texas. And there I was living with retired former G6 Sergeant Major of 3rd Corps. Which means he was the highest enlisted swinging dick on Fort Hood for a signal, you know, signal, like computers, transmissions of signals into the future, the future, so crazy. Anyhow, he just wanted to get stoned and ran up, well, I got a $500 electric bill uh, because, you know, from him growing weed, and he kicked me out because he was playing his music too loud. I needed to go to sleep to write a paper. And he just turned out, turned something that could have been a pretty good fucking living environment into something completely shitty. Um, the guy obviously needs help. And which is funny because that's actually part of the reason why we're going to be doing what we're doing here at, I know my first name is David, at david.naris.com. Um, we're going to be doing, we're going to be doing, um, we're going to be playing D&D. &D. We're going to be doing Curse of Strahd. Yes, that's right. Curse of Strahd. And, um, the overall goal is to, uh, uh get a game going, um, get me and my buddies, my stakeholders, whatever in the company, uh, uh, my vet friends and just kind of just literally open the table up and uh, start playing some games, build an environment, and hopefully, yeah, build a team. We all, we all do, we can get the business stuff out of the way at the beginning and then kind of just go into it. And hopefully it'll get the creative juices flowing that we can start, get the writer's room built and start um, working on um, my werewolf movie that we're planning on doing called um, She Beast. Um, it's going to be pretty amazing. I'm pretty, I'm pretty stoked about it. Uh, I'm wondering if I should, maybe I should look into copyright and Shebeast, the name, just to get it out there. Um, it's going to be great. I already wrote 10 pages. I think I got, I think I got some of the actors already cast. Um, pretty stoked. I'm pretty, pretty stoked. Um, uh, yeah. And so we're, the plan is we're going to shoot it on 35 millimeter film and if we need to colorize it, we'll do that later. So my goal is, since this is a studio and we gotta start somewhere, is like I said, we're gonna start streaming. We're gonna start streaming our games, hopefully start making some more videos uh, throughout the week and just get the label built or this, whatever you wanna call it, imprint studio. Um, but it's gonna be my home for me and my friends that are, who on the day to day, we just feel like we're damaged goods and we just need a, place to hang out and just talk about our shit especially after afghanistan that really that uh really kind of kind of twisted our noodles a little bit so um yeah yeah so uh nichito will be involved and brian cobb um brian already has a following on twitch and we will probably be uh, linking um, up together, this, you know, doing what we do. So he'll be helping us with that. We're going to be using the Foundry Virtual Tabletop System. Um, 
I'm already got maps and stuff for Curse of Strahd. It's gonna be it's gonna be pretty good. Pretty good. Yeah. So uh, we're hopefully we're gonna get everything put in the system and get the dice rolling. I'm hoping within the next couple weeks. So maybe this weekend, if worse comes to worse, it's just a matter of getting everybody together, uh, getting the schedules together. Um, even if it's just like maybe playing a couple hours, like on a weekday, weekday night. So, but we'll be able to do it. We'll figure something out. Now I'm, I'm sure you guys will all turn out and come out here and say, hey, this is pretty fucking amazing. These guys are rocking. And I'm like, oh yeah, yeah. It's going to be pretty fucking rad. I did just want to mention that uh, in the lead up to this, with the whole underlying theme to be better, positive mental health, and uh, everything, I uh, I asked our uh, our old uh, dungeon master for pretty much the last ten years um, if he wanted to get involved. Um, and he said, yeah, and he already had, he had an idea for a rogue that he wanted to create, which I might even create it myself. Um, but the next day he, uh, he committed suicide and so I'm kind of just like wanting to get this out there because it's kind of put a cloud on me. I don't want to say a cloud, but it's just, um, it just kind of forced me to th rethink about what was going on. Um, it's just, it's basically like, I know I got to, I mean, I got some pretty big shoes to fill, like, and, and I've been sitting there trying to like reading this stuff and learning the rules again and trying to understand applications and I'm just like wondering how the heck he did it you know because um, we just we just did book and paper and, and but he had all this stuff in his head and it was on the fly and could remember it which I always thought was the, the amazing thing that we could come back after like a month of not playing or two months or six months and he knew exactly where we left off and where we were going and uh It's just, it's, it's just one of those things, I guess. I mean, I don't know really how, how else to, how else to say it, but, um, I miss him. Cobb misses him too. And I, I know Nichito does because we were like, we were, yeah, we were a pretty tight unit for a while. Um, and we you know life happens we all move in different directions and everything but um like i said i was really kind of hoping he'd be here backstopping and the fact that we were like i'm doing this thing for mental health and everything and it's just like uh, i just want to just kind of i don't know i i it's just one of those things where you're just like you kind of like you know you're like what the fuck like literally like what the fuck so, um, yeah, just wanted to kind of talk about the elephant before we, we get going with this. But anyhow, we got, uh, we got Cobb, Brian, uh, Cobb, he's created Clank, um, his war forge, uh, from Eberron and he's going to be, uh, we're already working on the character backstory and Cheeto, um, will be making, he's making a monk, like a martial artist. Um, kind of like Shang Chi, um, and so yeah. So we're gonna we're gonna I'm just gonna yeah, we're gonna create characters and we're gonna create some characters and hopefully get the dice rolling on this and um, yeah. I guess we're gonna see what happens, but this is the first few steps of uh, actually uh, creating creating my media empire of the future. Media empire of the future.